say only the good die young, and such is the case when it comes to former BFA and Norwich University athlete Connor Roberts. A son, brother, uncle, and teammate, Roberts died of a heart attack last June. He was just 21 years old. Me and Connor grew up, uh, you know, two houses down. We went to daycare. Childhood friends and brothers Isaac and Zach Devoid went to head lacrosse coach Bo McDougall with an idea. It started as a competitive type thing. Let's do something against Norwich. Um, and Isaac said, you know, Connor brought people together. But let's remember Connor by bringing teams together. And it just started rolling from there. Climb for Connor was born. His brother Ben, he was the, the manager here at the Rockwall as a work study job, so we thought it'd be appropriate to have a, a climb. For 24 straight hours from 6 p.m. on a Saturday through 6 p.m. on a Sunday, the rock wall at Castleton was occupied. Connor's brother Ben, who played lacrosse and hockey for the Spartans, had the honors of making the 1,000th climb. In all, nearly 1,600 trips to the top were made. The event raised over $7,000 and counting for the Connor Roberts Memorial Fund. A lot of people have done a lot of phenomenal things. Norwich, Castleton, our high school back home, it's been awesome. And I think the way that like we've decided to live on, you know, Connor's memory is by doing things like this and raising money and, you know, trying to make sure that his memory continues to touch the lives of others. The men's lacrosse team took to Twitter, daring me to take part. Hey, Darren, Aaron, we got to get you up the wall. It was a challenge I graciously accepted. Yeah, so you just want to tighten, take those two and just tighten them like as hard as you can. Isaac showed me the ropes, starting with getting me in the harness. Does that feel like snug enough? Like if you push down on like the sides and stuff, we'll stay. Yeah, it looks good. Got plenty of hips for that. <laughs> yeah, it's a self-tightening knot too. So whenever you, uh, like if you, even if you fall, it actually like comes more tight. Okay, so I will not fall. Exactly. It's foolproof. Before I knew it, climb 1042 on the day was underway. Where do I go from here, that one? There were two routes, Route 9, Connor's number, and Simple Man, named for Connor's favorite song. Okay, so that's the one to steer clear of because it's deceivingly big, but you can't grab it. I went up Simple Man. Oh, I'm cruising now. Once at the top, I had three things to do. Hit the bar. I made it take a picture, and hit the shoes. There we go, I can reach them. 